what's up party people it has been a minute since i've talked to you um let's see quick update since i talked to you i stopped doing the detox uh i haven't stayed raw i've stayed vegan just not raw um trying to get things in order i'm still battling with this progesterone shot and like it seriously is not letting me release any water <laughs> so i'm trying to avoid um being put on a, a diuretic medically you know what i mean so i've been trying to do everything besides that um and nothing has worked yet <laughs> so but i'm still gonna keep trying because i really don't want to be put on a, a diuretic um mm -mm. so the shot is, I think it might be wearing off because Tom has now been here for four weeks and um, it wasn't here at all. So hopefully the shot is going away. Um, so yeah, anyways, to the topic at hand. I have literally now um, 61 days, 61 days till January 1st. So I have a task at hand. Um, Granted, yes, I am 50 pounds smaller than I was in 2010, but I'm not where I'm supposed to be. Um, matter of fact, I'm actually 69 pounds smaller than I was, um, no, in 2009. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hold on. Hello? Okay, so I don't remember what I was saying before I, um picked up the phone but what I do know is that I do weigh uh, 55 pounds less than I did in 2010 and I weigh 69 pounds less than I did in 2009 what I want to do is weigh <laughs> I want to weigh I want to be at least at my 70 mark my 70 pounds gone because I was there before you know what I mean I don't have any excuse to why I can't be 20 pounds is reasonable for two months you know what I mean um, I gave myself that much but I know I can do more. Um, I don't have any excuses. Like there's nothing stopping me from reaching my goals, but me. So I don't, I'm not gonna be apprehensive. I'm not gonna be scared anymore. I'm just gonna go for it because I'm so close. You know what I mean? So um, the fat girl has gotten her eviction notice. She has 61 days to kick rocks. She's got to go. By January 1st, I wanna be um, 210 pounds. That gives me that's like 20 pounds in the next two months. I know I can do more, but I'm just giving me some leeway. You know what I'm saying? And then by the second week in January, I want to be um, 199. And I'm speaking that and I'm putting that here on my channel because it is accountability. I'm tired of being the one who comes up here saying, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. But I'm still here. Like, I'm still looking like this. I mean... I think I look good, but <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I don't want to. I don't want to be heavy anymore. I want to reach my goal, and then I want to get into the stage of I want to get to 199 so that I can focus on the 170 and the 150. You know what I mean? I want to. I want to see myself progress. So I'm evicting the fat girl. She's gotta go, and that's my thing. Um, I am gonna document daily, but I haven't. Sorry, my nose is itchy. So I haven't decided if I'm gonna leave the videos private. Or if I'm going to post them. Um. But what I want to do is I want them to be like a journal entry. I want it to be like my diary. But, um, yeah. So I might disable the comments. Um, just because I don't, I, I don't want to lose focus on what it is. And I want it to be just what it is, is a journal entry. Um, <sighs> Probably every Friday or something like that around there, I'll give a real update. But every uh, every day from here forward, it's just going to be a journal entry. And if you don't see them, it's because they're private. I found this um, book, my planner, right? And I was looking at it, okay? And I wrote down my goals for 2011. And these were my New Year's goals. And the only one that I actually was consistent with was graduating college and um, passing my state boards. That's sad <laughs> that I only did one thing consistent, consistently. So I started writing new goals. So 
so I have new goals and um I'll be more specific with them later but right now it's just to like I told you the 199 by the second week of January 210 by January 1st um I'm gonna work out five to six times a week I have no excuse I have a gym membership I have a trainer who's working with me I have all the food in my refrigerator that could help me attain this goal I have no freaking excuse I can walk I can talk I'm able to move so why not you know what I mean do what I got to do and stop procrastinating. I will guarantee myself every morning for breakfast that I will incorporate fresh fruit, living raw fruit into my diet and that in every vegetable, um, in every vegetable, in every meal thereafter, lunch and dinner, I will have a steep helping of um, green vegetables. There, that's what it's going to be because sometimes I veer away from the vegetables. <laughs> but I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to. Um, so yeah, I haven't been eating raw. I've been eating vegan, but not raw. Uh, yeah, I'm taking this very seriously. This right here is my weight loss, um, book. It's going to have my vision board in it. It's going to have, um, everything in here that I need. My vision board, my journal, my food journal, all that stuff. Um, my trainer wants to see a food journal. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to rush this so I don't talk too long. But yes, balls to the walls, baby. Um, by January 1st, I bet it had been 210 or less. I will not let myself down. I'm tired of being the one sitting here saying, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. And has every reason in the world to do it. And not a single reason in the world not to do it. But still ain't doing it. I'm doing it. So, check me out. This is Eviction of the Fat Girl. Um, She's gotta go. Bags packed. 61 days and she's out of here. Out of here. Anyways, I'll see you guys soon. Deuces.